One of the best things about hand loading 300 blackout is rather than getting gouged for brand new brass off the shelf, you can use plentiful 223 cases from the range to make your own, and here's how. Run your lubricated 223 cases through a blackout resizing die, but initially with the decapping neck sizing mandrel removed to avoid crushing the case and possibly damaging the mandrel. The die will actually leave a convenient little reference line to guide you in the next step of removing the excess length. Most folks use a mini chop saw here, and even though I have a chop saw, I prefer my belt grinder because for me, it's faster and I just trim it down to that little line. Don't worry if your cut's not perfectly square, it'll clean up fine in a moment, but first a quick chamfer deburr and back through the resizer die. This time, with the mandrel installed, to size your new neck and remove the old primer. I recommend the Lee Case Trimmer. It works great and it costs only 13 bucks. To save your hands and speed things up, chuck it in a vise and the shell holder in a drill. Just go to your bottoms out, lightly chamfer deburr, and you're at a perfect 1.357 case length and ready to tumble your new 300 blackout brass. See you next time.